Interested in helping farmers work more productively and efficiently? Love hands-on technology in both an indoor and outdoor working environment? Then maybe you should look into a career in precision agriculture. Uh, my name is Dan Bossman. I am a technology manager for uh, Premier Grain based out of Toy Mills, Iowa. And I run all the data collection, data processing from all the equipment, and then uh, all the computer stuff in the office. I went to Kirkwood in 2000 for the GPS GIS program. I'm just going to wait for it to warm up and find some satellites. It uh, gave me a great uh, deal of knowledge as to how the satellites work, how the computers take that data and turn it into data that we can use. A large benefit of moving into the agriculture technology field would be job security. Uh, there's a lot of cooperatives, a lot of farmers that are needing a guy to work for the farming operation. That basically all they do is uh, the technology stuff. And uh, as technology progresses, there's going to be a larger need for guys with those skills. You could uh, find a job where, such as mine working for a farming operation. You could uh, find a job working for a cooperative, chemical companies, seed dealers, working for seed companies. Anybody who uses or is involved in agriculture and uses technology, uh, there should be an opening somewhere for that position. As farming operations get larger and, and it becomes more expensive to farm that acre of ground, and more guys move toward the technology side of things to help offset those costs a little bit, uh, there'll be a large opportunity for guys with technology skills or degrees in technology uh, that can help those guys get to where they want to be. Today's technology is revitalizing agriculture and providing us with exciting opportunities, such as field mapping and soil sampling using GPS and precision agriculture is a secure and rapidly growing technical field. For more information on anything you've seen today, explore our website at atetv.org. Thanks for watching.